Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's Monday, it is 6.30 p.m. I am officially on my children's rotation. It is like the first time I've ever done a pediatric rotation in residency. So I'm a little out of my element and like a fish out of water, but so far it's going well. I'm on call tonight. I thought I would vlog this week to kind of show you guys a different rotation and show you guys the experience. Um, today was nice. It was pretty chill. I just held the pager during the day, dealt with floor work and did some admin stuff of my own. Like I logged some cases. I sent some emails I needed to send all of that, um, which is always nice to have one of those days. And then tomorrow I'm doing surgery at one of our offsite places. So not in the hospital, but at like a surgery center in a little bit away. So I thought I would show you guys this week. Tonight is the college playoffs, so we're having wings while we watch. It is 8.30 p.m. I have just been like scrolling on my phone doing absolutely nothing productive. And I'm just gonna try to read a little bit and try to get some sleep. I'll keep you guys updated. It is 5 a.m. I, um, just had a little consult um, that I did not have to go in to see. We cover a hospital where I am and then a hospital like 45 minutes away. Um, and we do get consults from that hospital. And so uh, you have to kind of think about like the things that you want to know and things that you want to see and, and be really good communication with the emergency room doctors um, if they consult you just so you know you don't necessarily have to drive 30 minutes or 45 minutes to go see a consult. Um, so I did that. I staffed it with my attending um, and it turns out I didn't have to go see it. So that's good news for me. Um, it's kind of an awkward time because I am awake and I my alarm set for 30 minutes from now but so maybe I'll try to do like a little 30 minute nap slash just like chill for 30 minutes um but overall I mean not the worst night right like I slept from basically like 10 30 to now pretty good for a call night good morning it is 6 10 I am just making my breakfast and putting together some lunch for my day. Um, I'm going to the surgery center, so I'm not in the hospital today. I will be um, at a surgery center doing outpatient surgery. Hopefully we'll have a relatively early day. Um, and then I might stop my, by my parents' house because it's on the way to the surgery center. Um, that is kind of the plan. Like I said, I got a decent amount of sleep last night. No real issues with that. I'm making some eggs feed myself. I have like eight cases today, so they're quick though. So hopefully we'll get through it. Hello, it is 4.45. I'm home. Um, it was a really good day. Had six cases, like smaller outpatient cases, which was really fun. Um, and like worked with a really nice physician. So anyway, it was really a great day. Um, I'm home now, which is also great. And I'm not on call, which is also great. I'm eating this little snack. I'm, uh, this is gonna be a, a uh, experiment. This is like toasted French bread, some bruschetta sauce from Trader Joe's, and then these sardines. I had a variation of this when I was in Mallorca and it was really, really good. So I'm gonna try it. I'll let you know. There it is. Pretty good. All right, got myself enough energy to do a Peloton. Here's the receipts. I'm trying to run more because I'm training for a 10 mile race in like um, two and a half months. Um, so I'm trying to run more, but I also like think it's really important to cross train and also like it's hard to run when it's dark and cold outside. 
um, versus like just doing a Peloton. So I was going to go for a run today, go to my parents, but I just didn't have the energy. So I came back and made myself Peloton, which is equally as good. And maybe I will try to run on Thursday slash I'm going out of town this weekend. So I will definitely be running there. All right, it is 8.15. I showered, I shaved my face a little bit, um, and I made some tea, and I watched some lectures, and now I am going to read my book for a bit, and then Mark and I are gonna watch an episode of White Lotus. We're making our way through the first season, it's slow, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not like looking forward to every episode, but I wanna understand what the hype's about. So we gotta make it to the second season. Um, but yeah, that's kind of the evening, very chill. Hello, it is 6.50, uh, or no, sorry, it's 5.50. Um, wow, it feels later than that. Um, I got home from work about an hour ago, 40 minutes ago, and then have just been, I got paged four times on my way home, which is a first. So I've just been dealing with those pages. Um, but yeah, today was fine. I was not in the operating room. I was just handling stuff on the floor. Um, and really did not get much else productive done, which is like crazy. Um, because I, I felt like I was busy the whole day, but not like crazy busy. It was just like a slow trickle of being busy. But anyway, um, it was good. I'm just home now. I'm going to like sit and breathe and drink a seltzer for a little bit. And then there's a chance I may have to go to the OR tonight. I got a call from a patient. Um, so I may need to go if that, depending how that turns out. So we'll see. This is, this is how one stays warm on call. I'm a, I'm a burrito. Good morning. It is 6.20 in the morning. It's Thursday. I had a busier night on call than I have had. Um, didn't have to go in, just like a lot of calls from other hospitals. Um, but I had a lot of that last night, so, you know, it's just having to get information from the person who calls you and then kind of like ask pertinent questions and then like hang up, text the attending, being like, hey, I just got this consult, this is what I think. Then they might give you like something else, so then you call back and it's a lot of back and forth, so... Um, that was that, but I'm going to the off-campus surgery site again today. Um, so hopefully it'll be like a shorter day. I don't have to hold a pager, so that'll be good. And then I'm trying on my wedding dress tonight. So we'll see what my energy, energy level's like. I may try to go to my parents' house after and take a run. I said that last time and I didn't do it. Um, but the surgery, like the surgery center is here, my parents' house is here, and then the wedding dress place is here. So it's like, I don't want to come on my house is here. So I don't want to come all the way back. So we'll see. Anyway, I'm making some breakfast and then I gotta go. It is about 1.30 or 1.45. I ended up not having to do afternoon clinic, which is great. So now I'm taking a run. Currently I'm walking. But as you can tell, I just ran up a big hill. So this is my downhill walk just for a little bit. It's my wedding dress. I just have it. It's so wild. It's a little big, um, but I don't have to start getting alterations until um, August. So I have some time. So I have to keep it in my house until August and then go get it altered. I gotta get in shape. Good morning. It is Sunday morning. I haven't seen you guys in a while. I'm currently in South Carolina. Um, I'll catch you up on what happened. So Friday was a really good day. I just had like five small cases and I was done by like five. It was incredible. It was like my perfect day as a resident. Um, wasn't holding the pager, had five cases, like they all went really smoothly, they were all really fun, and then went and um, got on a plane. It was great. 
So I did that on Friday, flew to South Carolina. Friday night, just like got to the hotel, went to sleep. Yesterday, which was Saturday, I woke up and then at 10 a.m. got a hair trial redo for my wedding. Um, this is not it, obviously, but I really liked it um, and got a makeup redo just because the first time it was not exactly what I wanted and it was a little more overdone and I like don't wear makeup on a daily basis. Um, and I like came home and Mark was like, ooh, like, I don't know about that. So we both were just felt like it was a little overdone and didn't look like myself. So I redid it, I loved it. I looked like myself, but just slightly better, which is I think what you want on your wedding day. Um, and then had like a four and a half wedding planning, four and a half hour wedding planning meeting um, and went through a ton of stuff. I feel so good about it. Like I feel like we're on the right track. So that's all going really, really well. So did that and then drove down here to Spring Island, which is where I'm getting married, but also where we're staying this weekend. And then um, got dinner here and just hung out with my parents. Um, so that was last night and now it's Sunday and it's 10 a.m. and I slept for like 11 hours last night, which I also really needed. And now I'm gonna go for a run. I'm ready. Spectacular run views.